Hiya, Susanna. Good evening. Hello, hello. How you doing? Hello, hello, teacher. How are you? Linda, how are you doing? I'm, I'm fine, doing teacher. great, I guess. I think I'm okay. What about you, miss? How are you doing? Uh, I don't know if you're talking to me, but you're mute. <laughs> So I was, I saw you like very excited, but suddenly I was like, wait, she's weird. Yes, no, I was very exhausted, teacher, because I had a lot of uh, work and I tried to finish uh, my, uh, my what, my addendum at the uh, commitment with the government, but oh. <laughs> it's, so it's too difficult to finish now. I think I was a sus. Oh, I'm sorry <laughs> to hear about it. Yeah. Well, especially because it's just the beginning of the week. <laughs> yes, uh, but uh, i so sorry because I lost your class teacher. <laughs> oh, <laughs> For yeah. me, it's great to share with the co to, colleagues. To talk about <laughs> other things uh -huh, and, yes, and to talk to but... people. I, I have always thought that, you know, joining English classes is like um, getting into a different scenario, talking to more than just a language, it's like about sharing and, and uh, you know, relieving a little bit of a stress. So yes. I'm, I'm sad to hear you're having a hard time at work, but hopefully everything gets better. But thank you. I mean, it's so glad to see you. It's super, super nice to have you today. Um, thank you, teacher. How you doing, guys? I see Rafael already, Claudia, Cody. Good evening, guys. I think I saw Enrique too. So great to see you. How you doing? Fernando, hello. Um, Azucena, I think I couldn't listen to Azucena before. Did you have a good day, guys? Are you having a good one? Are you having a tiring day as well? Hi, teacher. Hello, how are you? Pretty good, and you? Nice, that's good to hear. I think I'm doing great. Uh, I don't know, for some reason, I feel this week is going super fast. Uh, that I, I didn't even realize today was Tuesday. So I was like, wait, what? <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm having this feeling that time is flying now. And also because we are finishing module next Tuesday. So I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> but, but it's good. It's good in a way, right? So that we are having this feeling as well. Let me see who else is coming. What about the rest of you guys? How are you? How you doing? Is everything okay? They could be very quiet today. Hello, yeah, good <laughs> evening. Hi, hey, hi fine, Rafael. Thank you. How are you? Fine, thank you. Hey, and Rafael, you? I hadn't seen you without glasses. That's nice. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I have hi. a headache. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. Is it migraine or just a normal headache? It's migraine. Migraine. Ooh. Yes. Okay. Okay. I got it. Well, thank you so much for joining. Sure. And if at some point you don't feel well, so you can turn off your camera. But thank you so much for your time. I think I heard Enrique. Hi, Enrique. Teacher, uh, good evening. I I don't participate last night because I was sick. I was I I had a terrible headache and uh, I couldn't uh, participate in the class. I understand that. But are, are you feeling okay now? Are you feeling better? Not much, but uh, I can. Oh. Uh, night. Oh, okay. I'm sorry to hear about it, but I hope you get over soon. Yeah, I know, I know. Well, it looks like 
Yeah, guys, I'm really sorry to hear you're not that well, but I just hope, you know, uh, probably if it is because of work, if it is because of stress, so I hope you get over this, <laughs> right? Like during classes. If not, well, let me just know um, in case you turn off your camera. Um, Adrian, good evening. Good to see you. Thanks a lot for joining. All right, guys. Uh, so we're going to be like checking a couple of things today. Yesterday, we were working with the ED, ING adjectives. Today, we are just going to practice a little bit of a speaking, right? But I have an activity here. So give me one second. So um, previously, we have been um, talking a little bit about movies. Um, so I have one activity now, and it is the following. We are going to try to guess the movie, but you, we are going to make two groups. Let me see how many boys and how many girls I got. So hi, Dago. I have Rafael. I have Dago. I have Adrian, Fernando, and Enrique, but in the girl side, only I have Yolanda, I have Claudia. Okay, let's do this like a gender battle, right? So let's do this boys against girls. And um, what we're gonna do is this. I'm going to send you guys uh, the the name of the of the the name of the movie in the chat in a private chat. All right, and uh, your group guys can or have to guess as many movies as possible, right? So we, I'm going to give you probably 30 seconds, one minute, so you can try to guess as many. Um, just there is a little um, condition in this exercise, and it is that you cannot mention the name of the, of the characters, and you cannot mention the name of the actors, right, from this movie. You can mention everything, except characters or um, actors, real actor names. Otherwise, this is going to be too easy. <laughs> okay, so, um, okay, so we're gonna be working boys against girls, but guys, I need one volunteer from each group. So I need one boy that is going to be explaining the movie to the rest, and I need a girl that is going to be explaining the movie to the rest as well. Okay. I propose Cory. No. <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> Cory, are you good? Please. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> oh, okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. So, Cory, I'm going to send the name of the movies, okay, to your personal uh, chat. All right. Um, okay. it, it is not like a lot of movies, so I'm just going to send you a couple of them. And uh, girls, you will have only one minute to try to guess as many movies as possible, right? So... But Cody need to... Uh, Explain the movie. On, No, turn on the, the camera or not, because you need to... To move you, your you hand are, or you not. Are not go, uh, it is not exactly like charades. Um, oh, okay. It is more description because of the internet that we don't know if uh -huh. the internet is going to work. Mm -hmm. So, but um, let me just write them right there. Give me one second. I had the names and I don't know what happened there. So give me one second here. What are you doing, teacher? We I'm are sorry. going to play guess the movie. Sophie! <laughs> <laughs> I have a headache. Oh, really? Oh, Guys, why? <laughs> what happened? This is our day. <laughs> no, but you know, I guess I guess also it is because of the weather, I think. The weather? Mm -hmm. Maybe. So I believe it is also related to the weather because it's been like too uh, humid, too hot. So I, I would say that is one of the reasons. Okay, I don't know if you are familiar with these movies. Uh, so Cody, I really hope you are. <laughs> okay, some, uh, well, I, they are really famous, I think. Okay. So... 
and if I I didn't watch, what is gonna happen, teacher? So if if you didn't watch it, that's okay. So you just continue. Okay. Okay. So I'm sending you the names of the movies. Um, you cannot tell the rest of the girls the names of the characters, the names of the movies. So yes, look at them and try to explain as many as you can in a minute. Are you ready? Girls, you can guess, of course. Uh, <clears throat> I choose just one. Uh, all of them, as many as you can. So in as many as the girls all guess. Them. Oh all God, of them. I yes. I okay. think I just, I watched the one of them. Oh, uh, but probably you have uh, heard about the rest. So it's like anything, any piece of information that you have heard, that you have seen, that probably just saw the trailer. So it's just like explaining them over. Okay, guys, so let's get started. Uh, Cody has one minute. Girls, you have one minute to guess as many movies as you can. <clears throat> All right, so let's get started. One, two, three, go, Cody. Okay, the first one is about... A ship or a cruise cruise here? I don't know how to say. Continue, no worries, continue. And all the the people that <laughs> Titanic. <laughs> okay. That's one. Continue, continue. It's okay. The next one is the is an, an animated movie. And there are a series and it's about found seven balls of the dragon. That's the name, uh, Goku and, no. Wait, but what thank is you. The name? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, that's two, continue, continue. That was girls, but it's fine, two. Okay. Continue. Five you... seconds. My God, say that. What is that? The, the Time's name? over. <laughs> yes. Okay. Um, Ball so, did you get Dragon Ball, 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 Ball. Uh, Did you get the Titanic? So I think is we're that, good with it? that. Um, okay. Yeah, so we can take it. Okay, boys. Uh, who is going to be your representative? Who know? Or volunteers? If you know a lot about movies. Boys or propose somebody. Teacher, Fernando. Fernando, okay. So Fernando, <laughs> um, you are the chosen one. Are you ready? Are you into movies? The showman. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, it's a uh, other tell story. <laughs> Like um, the, no, but the, the thing is that you have to do it super, super quick because okay. they have to get as many as possible. So, okay. okay. Well, I will try it. Okay, give me one sec. I'm sending you the names of the movies. Okay. Here you go. Okay. It's not like a lot. So, Fernando, you have a minute. Boys, uh, your challenge is to try to guess more than two so you can win over the girls, right? So, are you ready, Fernando? Can we get started? Yeah. Perfect. So, one minute. One, two, three, go. Okay, the first one is a man for uh, he steal for the poor. He is still a rich man and get a money and given the poor people. It's a man. He Boys. fight. Robin Hood. Exactly. Okay, well, continue, continue. Okay, in a city in the United States near to Houston, uh, a man is dead uh, everybody at night. Is in a city in the USA near to uh, Houston. Houston? Batman. Texas. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. Okay, a man is dead, everybody. I think in you a night. Continue. No, Texas. 
Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Continue. Continue. Nine seconds. It's a man. It's a man. He have a technology in her body, and she's he's a police. Three, Iron two, Man. No. One. Robocop. Time's over. <laughs> okay. Time's over. Time's over. So, oh my God, we have a tie here. Yeah, that was Robocop, right? So that was a tie. Okay. Um. So let's go to Muerte Subita. <laughs> So let's try to, um, so Cory, do you continue? Fernando, do you continue or do you want to switch with somebody else? Um, I can continue, teacher. You can continue? But with the, yes, but okay. with the same, with the... With all their okay. movie, right? No, I'm going to they send you this. the name of the movie. Mm -hmm. I'm going to send it over to you. Okay, okay, okay. Other movies? Yes. So, guys, we are going to do a little kind of um, discrimination listening exercise. So, boys, like Fernando and Cory, both are going to be speaking at the same time. So, you have to listen carefully to them, try to understand what they are saying, try to identify their voices, and get the name of the movie. So, the group that wins is the one that gets the movie first. Remember, this is boys and girls, right? So okay, the girls uh, need to hear me. Yeah, it's they me. need to listen okay. to. Boys need to hear me too. So don't get the movie of Fernando, okay? <laughs> don't help me. <laughs> but the help movies are say, going uh, to movies, be okay? different. Sophie, I come with you. <laughs> but the movies are going to be different because otherwise it's going to be too easy. So. Uh, Fernando, I'm sending the name of the movie right now. Okay, I'm scared. <laughs> no, 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 it's very, I think it's very um, super famous. <laughs> Have you seen it? I love it. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, so we are good. Okay. And, uh, and Cody. I'm sending the name of the movie. Let me know if you know the movie. Oh, let me. Ah. Oh my God. <laughs> Are you familiar with this movie? I think yes. Okay, perfect. Guys, we have maximum one minute. Remember, both are going to be speaking at the same time because I need you to identify sounds and, and pay like a lot of attention to listening there. So uh, the group that gets this first is going to be the winner. So Fernando is going to describe a movie. So boys, listen to Fernando. Uh, at the same time, Cody is going to describe a movie. So girls, you listen to her. And let's see who can get this movie first. Are you ready, guys? Yes. <laughs> yes. Fernando, ready to? Yes. OK, perfect. So you have maximum one minute. And remember, it's at the same time. So simultaneously, guys, go. OK, she's okay, a superhero. She's very sexy. Um, and all the men love her. Group of it's a the movie men about uh, a fight. A fight. <laughs> they, and he has uh, some slave. Um, men in black? No. Found, he's looking Wonder for woman. a ghost. Uh, and like they her. kill them. Like her. It's a it's a new movie. It's a new movie. It's a, for the last year. Continue, Cody, it's continue. An old movie. Very, and, very sexy. And, and here is an animated <laughs> series. It's about for Marvel. Um, a group uh, Captain Marvel. Looking for gas. Like her, like her. It's a it's it's, it's I mean, you're the... Ghostbusters. Spider-Man. Yes! Oh my god. I don't know how you guessed that. <laughs> Oh my god. I don't have any Guys, idea it's how very, you very that. sexy from Marvel. <laughs> it's Black Widow. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. I, I heard Fernanda saying that she was like super sexy. You were about to say the Scarlett Johansson and everything. But yeah. Claudia, you got it. So nice. <laughs> Thank very you. good job. Thank you, Claudia. Hey, you so <laughs> You're welcome. Very nice job. Okay. You Easy or idea. difficult? How do you feel when two people are talking at the same time? It's so difficult. It's a little hard, right? Yeah. It's a little hard to identify sounds. Yeah, so. It's a little bit of red line. But it's a has, challenge. It's so difficult. <laughs> it's so difficult to understand. 
Yeah, yeah. Fernando has a, a stronger voice, mm, but I think it's just the fact that both yeah, people okay. are talking, yeah. so yeah. we don't know where to focus. <laughs> okay, all right, guys. Um, so we're gonna like just uh, let me show you a little bit part of the vocabulary. Yesterday we were checking, and oh wait, wait, wait a second here. This is not the one. So um, in the platform, there is one exercise that is very interesting that is related to movies and to vocabulary. So I know you have already checked this, but let's just review super quick part of the vocabulary that, that we have for giving opinions. Um, so when we are talking about this kind of movie series, etc., for example, um, here we have four different categories. So we have awful, wonderful, stupid, and strange. Guys, can you give me some synonyms for wonderful? What other words can you use uh, instead of saying wonderful? Amazing, great, great. And amazing, great, okay. Greatest. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Awesome, okay. Fantastic. Fantastic, okay. Marvelous. Marvelous, okay. Spectacular. Spectacular, very nice. What else? Fabulous. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Gorgeous. Uh, oh, gorgeous. Uh -huh. Yeah, gorgeous. Uh, yeah, that can be used as well. Unbelievable. All right. What if we are talking about a stupid? Um, a stupid is not like a very hard word in English. So what other ways can we, how can we say stupid? What are Polish. some synonyms? Oh. Dumb Mad, or foolish. 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 Idiot. Idiot. Okay. Silly. Silly. Exactly. Okay. Very nice. What about strange? Weird. 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 Old. Odd. Exactly. So weird and odd. Okay. Any other? No, I don't know. Ideal shawl. Unusual, terrible. terrible. Okay, mm, but terrible is like bad. So terrible is more like really, really bad. And the strange is just twisted. For example, have you ever seen the movie, the Italian movie, A Hundred Days in Somo, in Sodom and Gomorrah, something like that? No. No. Okay. no. That is no. a really bizarre movie. Um, there are some bizarre movies that are like pretty, pretty bad, super twisted. So we have here a strange, weird, unusual, odd, uh, bizarre. That is another way to call it as well, something that is strange. Now, awful, awful is bad, really bad. Um, so, terrible. Terrible, okay. Disgusting. Disgusting, all right. Oh. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Okay. And we can also use the word dreadful. So dreadful right. is a synonym as well. Mm -hmm. And dreadful is like very unpleasant. So yeah. something that is not okay, something that is not fine. So we are going to discuss a little bit about movies today, but um, we are going to push vocabulary today, guys. So we are going to eliminate from today's practice um you cannot so from today you cannot use the words good you cannot use the words bad and you cannot use the words the word interesting okay we are going to be describing movies but what i want you to do guys is to vary to modify your vocabulary so, for example, if you want to say, oh, the movie is good, the movie is nice, I'm going to include nice as well. So, instead of saying nice, what other words can you, can you use? Oh, like wonderful, uh, amazing, um, fabulous. Well, uh -huh. interesting. But you cannot use interesting. So, another word. So, oh, what okay. we are going to try to do, guys, is to change or to um, make our vocabulary a little bigger by using synonyms, right? So you cannot say good, you cannot say bad, you cannot say nice, and you cannot say interesting. Now let's do the following. Let's set a penalty. 
because this is going to help us a lot to modify the vocabulary we use and to sound more intermediate, more advanced. So guys, if you forget, and if you say nice, good, bad, or interesting, what can be the penalty? Can you give me something easy? No dancing, no singing, please. Please sing. Sing in English. Sing in English, please. Sing in English. Is that okay with the rest of you guys? Yes. Yes. At least the yes. chorus, yes. right? The happy birthday chorus. <laughs> okay, yeah. so or a ranchera. Sing ten seconds. Okay, in English. Ten uh -huh. I think that is enough. Okay. Be because, Teacher, yes. Who want who want to be a millionaire? <laughs> or, or singing by a <laughs> Singing for a dream. No, this is going singing to be for singing a for a penalty or vocabulary. Singing for a penalty. Okay. <laughs> okay. So just remember the 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 um, the banned words today. So you cannot use good, you cannot use bad, you cannot use nice, and you cannot use the word interesting. So push yourself, right, to use other words, to modify the way we talk. I'm going to show you how um, now, like, a couple of movies that we are going to be describing. So take a look at them. I don't know if you are familiar with them. So we have The Greatest Showman, you have Troy, you have 60 Seconds, The Notebook, Up, Shining, uh, Food, um, mm, mm, Good But Ugly, Love Actually, Friday Night Lights, and A Lot of the Rings. So what we are going to do is a little review of these movies, of the movies you have seen, okay? But guys, remember, you cannot use good, you cannot use bad, nice, or interesting. So monitor yourself to try to uh, give your opinion on the movies, right? And if you have not seen them, don't worry, just invent it, make it up, or what you have heard, so that is okay. I'm going to send you guys uh, to two groups. So you can talk about the movies, give your opinion about them, and then we come back and we are going to see if we can have some uh, fluency activities. So go there, guys. You are welcome to go. Uh, we have only like 10, 15 minutes. So go, go, go and review the movies. Give your opinion actually about the movies.
animate? We can, Anim we can, we can talk about this movie, but <clears throat> if you, <clears throat> if you have, have watched this movie, I think you, oh, wait. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> <clears throat> we are in the principal room, yeah. no? <clears throat> Yes, the teacher shared. The only one that I saw it was the Lord yeah. of the Ring, to be honest. It is a it is a Shantrax redemption. <laughs> the, 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 the movie. Yes. Or what? In the in the picture the teacher shared, I think. Can you see the picture? Yes. 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 Okay. I think the only movie that I have seen is The Notebook. <laughs> and I, I also, have seen The Notebook and The, the Troy. And also the, Troy. the Lord of the Ring. And Up. Ah, I, I saw Up too. Mm -hmm. All right, up tell us about, tell us about it. Um, for me, uh, it was, uh, uh, let me see, a wonderful movie, uh, a romantic and wonderful movie. I like it a lot. And it was um, a love history <clears throat> between... This tragedy is an action. It's tragedy, but it's an action. For me... Uh, not is okay the, the combat for example if you see uh, have uh, some uh, i don't remember how do you say ah, choreographies choreographer miss the choreographies for the fights um, yes like the stones yeah are very excellent it is from the action in this movie you have action tragedy love it's a complete it's a complete uh, movie Troy. And you forget something important because it's the history about, about uh, Roma, Rome. No, no, it's in Rome. No, uh, it's Rome. Greece. 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 Yeah. Greece. And Troy. <laughs> yeah, even if I be so bad with the movies because I don't like them. <laughs> so, like, when it was, you was Troy is hard. I can the feel. Hard. What? I think it's very hard history. Oh, yeah, it's very Why? Good. I love Mr. Bean. I love Mr. Bean. It's a comedy. It's a comedy. All the comedy. Because it's very quite comedy. comedy. It's really... quite comedy. Like the Chavo the Locho is my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And he don't need, he don't need to speak. <laughs> Only mega yes sir. What do you say? It's mine. And uh, what do you thinking about up? No, oh, it's a cute one. That movie was very emotional it. for I don't remember the name of the of the lead of the of the boy. Yeah. Um who was the name? Kevin. No, Kevin is the is the big bird, right? Brian is the animal or is an animal. I don't remember the name of the, or even if the, the name of the grandpa, but it's it's a movie very very interesting. Very, I think that the the content of the movie is very friendly for families. So make something like I think that one of the point was change your way to be don't when cry. the grandpa. Don't sorry. cry. Teacher, Sorry, what is my here? A, a picture of the movies because I don't think for me, it. up is a exceptional movie. I think I do, yeah. Also, because you know, the grandpa changed her way to be like a rule, like very, you know, angry grandpa. So, 
the little boy changed the way to be, the way to, you know, be with the person. Also because all the adventure that they live in the Venezuela, I think there is um, the, I don't remember what it was the cascada. I, I don't know who say cascada. But yeah, it was very, very friendly, very cute movie. Waterfall. Um, yeah, water, water, waterfall. Waterfall, yeah, the waterfall. Yeah, thank you. So it was very like, oh my God, you can change even be old. <laughs> so it doesn't matter that. Okay, next. Um, up. This is the uh, animation of, but is yeah, it's from Disney? Uh, no, no, DreamWorks. No, DreamWorks. Disney. DreamWorks. DreamWorks. Yeah, DreamWorks. Yes, the different. DreamWorks is. Right. Oh my God! The learn yeah. Dream. <laughs> hey guys, I have a question for you. I have a question for you. No. I want a. Uh, you hear the music and you say, what's the movie? Okay. The Lord of the Rings is boring. <laughs> no. And, and uh, because, because that is the, the, the war uh, between the Agamemnon's reign and the uh, Paris Alejandro reign is uh, is the war between them because Elena and all the the movie is about uh, the war and uh, finally uh, Achilles died and Hector died and I don't know if if is it it's boring for for you guys, but I really love the the movie and the book. It isn't boring. Sorry. It isn't boring. Uh, I have just watched the movie, but I haven't read the book. Ah, you haven't read the book. Oh, I recommend you. And, and is is no, there is another book. Um, after this book, after the the book of the the Troy. Uh, it's uh, its name, its name Odyssea. I don't know if you ever. La Iliada y la Odisea. Yes. These two books uh, are really, are really amazing for me. Oh. So, another, uh, the next one, or oh, the next one of you guys, uh, another uh, movie. I think Yolanda can can share that, that opinion about the Shantrak Redemption. I did. She participated. She was the yes. first. Yes, but uh, hi, Monique. Hi, guys. Uh, thanks a lot for coming back. So we were like practicing a little bit with the, um, let's see here. Yeah, I think I'm missing still some people here. Okay, how was your practice? Were you able to identify most of the movies? Have you seen most of the movies or not really? I, it's a me also. Why? Why um, did you? What happened? I don't know. The same words. I, I say the same. <laughs> so you use good, but nice and interesting. <laughs> no, are you serious? 
Okay, so did you sing? Terrible. Uh, but but did you sing in the group? Did you sing in the group? Yeah. So, no, están todos. Ah, ya está. no, no, I mean, uh, the penalty was if you said good, bad, nice, or interesting, so you had to sing, right? Did you sing? I said bad, I said interesting. Okay. All of the words. <laughs> oh, okay. But, but that is cool because I think we can listen to you singing. <laughs> Okay, guys, what about the rest of you? Um, did you say good? Were you able to change your vocabulary a little bit? Were, were you able to say like different words or still good and bad? No, no. I didn't. No. In our group. no, it was easy. It was easy. Yes. <laughs> Okay, very nice, because that is the point, you know, um, the more we vary the vocabulary, the easier it come. So uh, thank you so much, Sophie, for volunteering. <laughs> okay, and for singing the 10 second, uh, the 10 seconds chorus, right? But we're going to do it uh, almost at the end. Guys, we are going to work a little bit with fluency. In the previous activity, we kind of uh, tried to aim at this type of exercises, but let's see if we can work it out a little bit. Um, normally, we have some words that are considered fillers. So a filler is when I have nothing to say, when my mind goes completely blank, I can use some words to continue speaking, even if I don't remember what to say. So what are the most Teacher. common feelings that you use? Yes, Enrique? It's, it's as muletillas in Spanish? Mm, kind of muletillas, yes. Kind of muletillas. Mm -hmm. Those are muletillas. So yeah. what are some, some words that we can use if you don't know what to say? Or if you don't remember one word, for example, and you feel stuck? Um, for example, um, um, okay. In English, it's um, in Spanish, it's... Um. Uh, Ah, uh -huh, yeah, that's Do you remember right. the teacher? The what? Do you remember the teacher? The, the last president, the teacher? Um, and the, the oh, teacher. Really? Uh, Mr. Seren. The, the last president, yeah. Sanchez Seren. Oh. Sanchez Seren. I don't remember. <laughs> I, don't, I had forgotten about him. Okay. So, but, but there are some other expressions and not necessarily one word. So in English, we can use fillers that are a little longer because the point is to continue talking. So for example, um, allow me, uh, I can use as a filler, like allow me one moment. Um, so allow me one moment. Allow me one second, all right? We can use other words like, let me think for a moment. Let me think about it. Let me think about it. Or like full sentences like, oh, that's very interesting. Oh, that's a good question. Um, I don't really have an answer. So the point in English is not to be with dead air that we call it, not to be quiet thinking, because that looks like you don't know what to say, but you can continue talking by just using some feelers. So what other expressions have you heard? It is very common, for example, to use well, and we can also use, you know. Um, do you know, do you use any other expression, guys? What else do you use? I usually keep in, uh, I usually keep in silence. I don't know if this tend to discourage that. I always say that, 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 that. Okay. So what we are going to try to do is not to be silent, you know, but to continue talking, even if we don't know what to say. And this is why I came uh, with these movies, because some of them we don't know about, we have no idea about them. But the point is to talk regardless if we know something or we don't know anything. So this is what we are going to try to do. Yes, Enrique. In fact, this is an example. In fact, you you say the 
the, the, the other the other time. Oh yeah, we can use in fact like to clarify, right? Mm -hmm. So we can use in fact. Yeah, that wouldn't be a filler because um, in fact you clarify, but we you can use the other one that is so, um, and this is a filler. So yeah, okay, guys, what we are going to try to do is to speak for, we are going to start with one minute. So one minute is speaking, but non-stop, okay? So you cannot stop at all. I'm not saying speak super fast. No, what I'm saying is whatever you want to say, whatever your, your ideas are, just keep on talking, all right? So um, take your time to talk, but don't keep quiet, don't keep silence, right? So that is going to be the challenge right now. I'm not saying speak super fast like crazy. No, I'm just saying speak nonstop, right? So you are not like, mm, mm, because normally when we don't remember how to say one word or in Spanish, we know the word in Spanish, but we don't know it in English, our mind goes blank. And we keep on working or we keep on looking for the word in Spanish. So what we are going to do is, um, if you don't remember, that's okay. Just continue, okay? So continue, change the word, change the idea, but keep on talking, right? So, guys, who is who wants to give it a try? Do you do I have any volunteers? I'm gonna write them in the chat so you can have it there. I want to prove myself. Okay. Perfect, perfect. So we're gonna be like describing movies. We are going to give you one movie, okay? Um, you have one minute, exactly one minute to just keep on talking. So push it. And if you don't know how to say something, if you don't remember the word, look for other words, look for synonyms, look for other ways to say it, but try to continue in English. So, do you want to pick the movie or do we give you the movie? Give me. I don't know. Okay, <laughs> that's okay. I can, we can give it to you. Guys, uh, can you name a movie you have recently seen? Or a movie that is like quite famous? Titanic. Oh, <laughs> okay. <Little> mothers. <laughs> Okay, Titanic. I guess I guess everybody has seen it, right? Except me. Okay. <laughs> okay, Sophie, your movie is Titanic. You have one minute to tell us about the movie, but just remember, um, if you're if you are like blank, so you saw the words, but try to continue talking. Like, allow me one moment. This is really difficult. Let me think for a while because I don't know what to say. But just keep on talking, right? So. Ready, Sophie? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Let's do it. One, two, three, go. <laughs> Titanic for me is a drama movie and a history movie because talking about uh, 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 a ship that. <laughs> was built in 1992 and has 200 to continue that's okay continue continue make it work <laughs> I know. and I love this movie because uh, the history um, to love uh, Three, uh, two, two one oh. time is over <laughs> okay very nice job no very nice job I know congratulations Sophie no but but you did it nicely you know you did it nicely and uh, and normally I listen to you uh, using Spanish words. I didn't listen Congrats. to you today using Spanish. So that was good. That's a very nice improvement. Okay, guys, who's next? Who wants to give it a try? It's only one minute. Okay. Me, teacher. I was gonna say victims. <laughs> okay, Cody, let's go with you. 
Okay. Uh, do we give you the movie as well? Yeah, give me the movie. Oh, very nice. Okay, guys, <laughs> what is a movie you have seen that you think Cody can tell us about? What's an easy movie, please? Cold. Nah. Cold. Uh, what what is uh, the, the last movie you remember, guys? I never have, I never have seen. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not familiar with that one either. Okay, I'm talking about the Toy Story. Okay, I have never seen that one. <laughs> okay, uh, so it's a minute. Oh Same thing, you know, try to make it work. Uh, if you get blank, just continue, right? So just try to continue. So one, two, okay. three, go. Okay, that's, the Toy Story is an animated movie and it's about uh, many toys that they are alive, you know? And when, when the kid um, isn't in the, in, the, in the room, so they uh, live, uh, live their lives and, and they have um, an special mission, like when is the, the kid's birthday, there is, there are um, hop, hopping, uh, there are hopping for a new toys and for a new friends, you know? And the, the movie is about a new toys that is, um, uh, I don't know how to say astronaut. And time is over. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that is only one we know. That was like that is astronaut actually. It's a little bit. Okay. I know, but we, it means that we can talk more time, so we can make it work for a longer period of time. Thank you so much. That was a very nice one. That was a very good try. Okay, Adrian, I see Adrian. Like, please pick me, pick me. So, Adrian, I'm I'm ready for you. It's only one movie, okay, uh, and only one minute. Guys, we are going to be in increasing the amount. So probably tomorrow is gonna be two minutes in a row, and then three minutes, and then four minutes, and then so forth. Because the idea is that you can keep on talking, right? And uh, if you don't know how to say something, you just continue. Adrian, uh, can you please select a movie? Uh, I don't know. Hi. Uh, is free is 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 free uh, uh, gender the movie? Yeah, yeah, any gender. That's all right. So any gender. Um, uh, Pearl Harbor. Oh, I've never seen those movies. Nice. Okay, ready? Uh, okay, Go. I'm ready. Um. Okay, uh, the Pearl Harbor is the classic movie and the talking about for the for worldwide second for war is the is the Japanese and they invited uh, to Hawaii for Pearl Harbor City. And in the movie is talking at the romance and the principal actor in the Ben Affleck and the second actor, I don't remember, mm -hmm. is the principal mission is destruction for the island? Cities, cities, cities and, the, and the Japan. Uh, by flyers, uh, the pilot is... Um, ah. Continue, let me think. Allow me one minute, just continue. Okay, okay. Um, Relax. And time is over. <laughs> okay. I blocked my, block my brain. I, I know. Remember the movie. I know. That is exactly what happens. So our mind goes blank. Let me write that word down. Yes. So my mind or my mind goes blank. So, blank. yeah, my mind goes blank. So this is the expression that we use when exactly when we have like something here and we cannot think mm -hmm. of anything. And, that, and because that happens is that we use expressions like 
allow me one moment. I cannot remember more details, but you keep on talking and the time continues passing by. Very nice job, Adrian. So that was a good description. I have not seen the movie, so now I got a clearer idea what the movie is about. Let's go with the last person. Uh, who wants to be the last? Teacher, I want to continue. <laughs> oh, this is not very good. Okay, are you ready? So I select the so. movie so you can pick it. Mm -hmm. uh, really? Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me think a movie that I have seen recently. Okay. Um, but I don't know how to say in English. <laughs> What's important. the uh, you can say the name in, in in Spanish because English and Spanish Spanish names are different, so it's not a good idea to translate them. What is the Spanish name? Uh, Encanto. Yes, the Disney uh, Disney movie. Mm -hmm. Just say Encanto. That's okay. Okay. Let me look for the name. I Ready? Will try. Yes. Go. <laughs> okay. And the movie that I have seen uh, recently um, is called Encanto. It's um, a Disney uh, movie. Uh, in, in, it was uh, a beautiful mo movie for me. Um, the, the history began uh, when uh, every member of a family received a special um, charities. Um, let me think about this, and um, and that's why the the grandmother think that they are special. But the problem starts when uh, a beautiful um, teenager um, um, discover um, or, or she realized that they and that she didn't receive a a charis, a, a special charis. And, and she decided to investigate the history of the family. Mm -hmm. And she discovered that it was an, an uncle, that every, every member of a family thinks that he was die, but it's a lie. Okay. <laughs> and it's a lie. And let me think, what else? Um, uh, the for all the family uh, is uh, just um, getting getting some troubles uh, for this history because they don't um, they don't want that um, anybody uh, knows about the real history of the uncle and the uncle is called Bruno and that's why they sing uh, a song called. Um, we we don't speak about Bruno. Time is <laughs> over. <laughs> As we said, a very good job. You know, I lied to you. I placed it for two minutes, so you didn't speak for the one. You were talking, you know, really? continuously for I two minutes. Believe. Yes, that was nice. Thank I think you. we got the full idea. A uh, very good use of connectors. Very good use of simple past as well. And the, and the ideas were like super coherent. So very nice. That was two Thank minutes. Thank you. Yeah, so you made it. I was good. surprised. <laughs> so that sounds like a good surprise. Okay, no, guys. No el tiempo. <laughs> uh, I mean, yeah, but, but you gave us a lot of information. So we're going to try to increase it. Um, I would like to listen, for example, to Vero that I hardly listen to, <laughs> okay. uh, to Dago tomorrow. So we're going to try to increase a little bit more, you know, so instead of one minute, we're going to try to make it two minutes and so forth. Guys, very nice practice. That was a very good exercise. Thanks a lot for that. Um, just a little reminder, guys, try to finish the platform if you haven't done so, uh, because we're finishing next week. So, you know, if you have it ready, so that is perfect. Thanks a lot, everybody, for your attendance. I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Please don't miss it. Have a good night. Good Bye, night. everyone. Good night, good night for all. Thank you. Bye.